it, it's hard to say exactly why I and a lot of other people in this business do what we do. Although it may seem like a lot of fun to be around the water and working on boats, just like everything else, the fun wears off pretty quick. Especially when you're up to your elbows in some horrible substance or in a, in a less than desirable corner of a boat. That was really bad. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Shelter Island. The roots of the company started out as a custom boat building company starting in 1938 and my father was born in San Diego in 1915. My participation in the business started at a very early age um, as a boatyard rat. I probably should have run away from home and, and had more fun as a kid, but I, I spent quite a bit of time here cutting my teeth and, and actually learning a trade when a lot of my other friends were out screwing around having fun. For many years I thought, even when my father was still alive in the 80s, that what's available in a medium-sized motorboat is not very good. You go to a production uh, builder and you go to a dealership and what they have to offer really isn't just a simple, clean, straightforward boat that looks good, works good, and doesn't have a lot of flashy, blinky things that really become worthless once you're out on the water. This is a, uh, at best, a custom business. Every single boat is different. We are rebuilding uh, Kettenberg 50, which is a boatyard that's now out of business, but was located just up the street. I'd say they ran the gamut between custom and semi-production boat building in wooden boats. Normally, in a good economy, we'd be uh, overwhelmed with just the basic maintenance projects, and now we're able to, to devote a lot of time to a, a long-term project such as that. People need to be able to relax and have fun on the water, and I think we need to focus more as a community on making sure people stay connected to how they can get out and, and enjoy their life and, and not complicate things more than they need to. I have a three-year-old son and I hope to, you know, keep his interest in, in being on the water. He, he really enjoys it. I mean, uh, he, we get him on the boat and he just thinks it's the greatest. And I think it's simple enjoyment. Hopefully he'll listen to his father and run away from home before he gets stuck here like I did. <laughs>